Hey everyone, it's Carol Ritchie. It's time for your daily cheer. I'm here at the Village Market parking lot in Colon, Michigan, the magic capital of the world. These are the new pop-up shops that are happening in our neck of the woods starting in Memorial Weekend. And this is Nyla and her sweet husband, and it's Jack, right? Yes. Jack, yay. So spreading cheer is so important, and we've been talking about how to do that. And Jack, you said something about smiling. Oh yes. What's how is why is that important? Being cheerful. Why is that important? <laughs> when you spread a smile, you see, love comes from where it is sent. So if you send a smile, you receive a smile. Oh, that's great. That's so that's so simple and so important. But the simple life is the good life. We don't have to impress anybody. All we have to be is simple enough to smile. And we'll get a smile in return. Thank you so much, Jack. That just is perfect. And Nyla, you love to crochet, and you have these wonderful new lake bags that are coming out, which yes. are great. You, you guys have a goat farm, which you have soaps and lotions and all kinds of things. Yes, so, and washcloths and scrubbies. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to put the website down there so that they can find out where you guys yeah. are. So how do you like to spread cheer with the many gifts that you have? Many gifts that I have. Yeah, you got so many gifts. You crochet. I can't mention them all. I know, right? <laughs> right. Do you share them? Do you like to share those and teach others? No, the ones that I'm doing right now, I got. Uh, I make prayer shawls for cancer survivors. Oh, that's. I've given. I think twenty six of them. I just walk up and I see that they're a survivor. Yes. And I just give it to them. I make a prayer shawl, pink and white. I'm working on one now for a twenty three year old girl. She cannot work. She's got liver disease. She's got sugar. She's got rheumatoid arthritis and kidney pain. Oh, wow. So. Thank you and bless you for sharing those many gifts. Now that is a, indeed a blessing. And I think the two of you are kind of an unstoppable team. I think that <laughs> you guys think. are awesome. Our yeah. biggest sharing asset is our fainting goat farm. <laughs> yes, tell that me about we that. We have an open invitation for everybody to come and bring their children and get acquainted to fainting goats. Fainting goats, oh my gosh. Well, the fainting goat go. is absolutely really? the only true American breed of goat. Okay. All others are imported. We're trying to get people to get out there and raise them so they can be repopulated. There's only probably about 2,500 all out. That's all there is. Wow, wow. Fanning yes. goats are a dying breed. Okay. So we need to get them multiplied. Okay, wow. <laughs> if anybody could do it, y'all can. And well, you. We got, we got one goat that's given us four, three times. Oh, my. And God. she's kept them all. That's great. That's a rarity. That is a rarity. Well, see, you know, it comes from your heart. And if you have a passion and you rally the team and rally the world, you can do it. So thank you so much to you both. We'll see you guys again for sure. Thank oh, you yeah. for spreading this. We're going to be your neighbor. <laughs> That's right. The neighbor the here. Pop-up shops here at Cullen, Michigan, the magic capital of the world. Love you guys. Give them a wave. Bye. Woo. Bye. Blow a kiss. Yay. <laughs>